What's up, man? It's your boy Moon Dog Three Seven Three Two. Hey, I got my duck season, you know, rabbit season, John on. But uh, back to these questions, man. Quick question, man. I talked to my cousin. You know what I'm saying? He's a very independent thinker. He does. He makes things happen. He doesn't blame his party. He doesn't blame the government. He just gets out there and do it himself. He don't rely on any political party, right? Or any religion or anything like that. He makes his stuff happen. Even though he's a Dallas Cowboy fan, but I need to hear no doubt. So I was asking a question about should we cancel Black History Month, right? He got all type of responses and stuff like that. But this is the this is what he wanted me to ask you all, right? So what if during Black History Month all other ethnicities and races or whatever spent their money with us, right? What if all other restaurants were packed with Asian, Hispanics, Japanese, white people, like the soul food restaurants that a lot of us own, right? But at the same time, he also said, um, why don't we remember who supported us when it was time for us to support them? Because, you know, we go out there and spend money with everybody. Oh, we want some hair. Let's go to this Korean spot. We want this. Let's go to this spot over here. Oh, Chicago. Y'all got whole areas that y'all know the type of people that y'all buy from, right? Because it's, it's cheaper. It's not quality. Um... But they're going to say, why don't black businesses have their customer service and everything up to par, right? Why everybody in the black business, especially at the counter, why do they always have attitudes? So here we go. What we need Black History Month, now that it's over, if we just supported our, ourselves and supported our friends, supported our family, and supported our own. What do y'all think? 